Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let us go through Sultana's dream, guys. Okay, so from the name itself, we can say it is a dream, which is, which occurred in Sultana's. Fine. Okay. So let us draw two girls. Okay. So basically, the main concept or the main story runs be between these two guys. Okay. So basically, she is a Sultana and she is sister Sara, guys. Okay, so let us start the story. So I'll be just explaining you here. So after that, we'll be going through the point so that we'll be having a clear idea. Okay. So basically, Sultana came, came to home and she was, she sat in a chair and she was ready to sleep, guys. So she was just laying down and she slept. Okay. So at that time, Sister Sara came into the house and she asked Sultana that, shall we go outside for a, for a type of just going outside and coming back like just roaming outside so it is in 19th century guys so in 19th century there used to be many things right like only men should be outside and women should be in house they should do the household activities only like that there could be many many things right so at that time finally somehow sultana accepted that and they both went outside guys okay so both went outside so it was a night basically so when Sultana observed, came outside and observed that it is morning already. Okay. So in morning, whenever she observed around, around her, so there will be many people roaming outside, right? So she observed only female guys, like women, only women she found. So basically in that 19th century, there used to be only men roaming outside, like doing jobs and all those things were done by men only. Basically women are indirectly arrested in the houses. So they, they used to do only household activities like that. But when she observed, when Sultana observed that only women are outside. So she was just in a kind of shy or thinking somewhat negatively that what, why, where am I, what is this? And she, there are many things running in her mind. So she, she directly asked Sister Sara that why women are roaming outside and what is the reason, what is this? She was asking in that way. So Sister Sara told that this is ladies land or ladies world i think so lady land yeah lady land so she t she answered that it is lady land so here she told she also told that here the roles are exchanged so that is nothing but the men are in the houses and women are doing works and all those things so basically women she says that women are more powerful than men so she, in that way she used to say and she also said that we run different different technologies like we use solar energy for electricity and we use uh, different different machineries to do many things like that. She used to praise them, praise girls or women. Fine. Okay. So she, so Sultana asked that why, why are men in, in houses and why we are roaming outside? So in that way she asked. So then sister Sarah replied in this way. So she told that when there was a war on us, Basically, in military, we will be finding only male men, right? In that age, in that time, 1990s. So, when men were defending, so the they defeated, guys. So, the, so they defeated. So, the king or the queen has passed a rule to fight against the opponents for women. So, basically, she or he told that for, they gave a chance for women to fight in the war, guys. So, basically, luckily, women made it to one so basically they used some kind of mirrors and all those solar energy like reflection reflect reflecting and all those things and they won the war so there was a small agreement that if they win the war they should exchange the roles so indirectly the men should be in the houses and the women will be ruling the whole place so whenever there is any kind of emergency that a woman cannot do so at that moment the men will be requested to come out so in that way the rules have been applied so so this is what happened guys so at the end, Sultana woke up from her dream, guys. So basically, this whole story is a dream. So, so she finally woke, woke up from the dream. Okay. And she narrated her story. And we are reading it. Fine? Okay. So now let us go through some points, guys. So that if, if it is asked for your in your exam, you can write it. So Sultana dream is the famous science friction story. Story. Written by the guy named... Please read it, guys. I cannot. I, I am not able to pronounce it properly. In 1905, okay, the story showed about the women ruling 
exactly in the place of women we you will be finding men and men in place of women so exchanging their power places okay the story started in this way the narrator was sleeping and thinking about the indian womanhood so if you find in any question the indian womanhood you can write this guys because this is the main concept of indian womanhood so that is nothing but indian womanhood we will be calling them as house household women okay so she did know that whether she fell in a sleep or not so basically she has no idea that whether it is a dream or not so in the initial stages so a friend sister sara entered the room and asked her to come outside for a walk in the garden okay so she asked so the narrator said narrator says the that okay so the narrator accepted and they started moving outside so but the narrator she noticed only women are outside and she is uh, internally she is uh, a bit fear about it guys so why why are only women outside so in that way so then sister sara said that this is women land or lady land so that is the reason why only lady are outside okay so the narrator looks around and sees the la- sees that lady land is like a garden the streets are filled with flowers and all those things so sister sara said that kolkata could also be look like this if men wanted to so basically in 19th century only men used to be outside so that is the reason why sister sara told the answer in this way okay so the narrator then asked where are the women sister sara said all men sorry where are men guys so she asked where are men so men are all indoors just like women in india okay sorry for that guys just give me a second okay okay so in india this is men right okay so men in india the women here are all doing all the works they do many works at home like they efficiently manage everything and business and everything they used to do guys okay okay so they use different different technologies like solar energy flying cars and everything so basically in the initial stages men used to focus on military but when there is a war they lost it guys so then women fought and with the help of some solar energy and mirrors they with some strategies they have successfully won the war so from then the queen decided that the men are in indoor hence the women are ruling it so the narrator tours the land lady land but at the end she wake up from the dream and discovers that it was a dream and she was still in india in in her chair itself so recognize that it was a dream so i hope everyone got a small edit guys just go through the points guys sorry for that i was not able to explain the story properly sorry for that thank you thanks for watching